alleging that the Karnataka government Shakti scheme, which provides free bus ride to women across the state, has been causing them loss, the Karnataka Private Transport Association now called for a bunt in the Bengaluru city. And today, in Bengaluru city, you will not be getting to see any autos or cabs or any private transport vehicles plying in the IT city. You will only have the BMTC buses, the government buses that will be providing service today. Now, there are various demands that have been put forth by the private transport vehicles, auto rickshaws and cabs who, are, who have called for a ban in Bengaluru today. One, they want this uh, Karnataka government Shakti scheme to be extended to the private vehicles as well. If the government does not fulfill its demand of extending the Karnataka Shakti scheme to the private vehicles, they demand that a monetary compensation that needs to be provided to the private vehicles. For these two main reasons and various other demands as well, the Karnataka's private transport associations, as many as 32 private transport associations have called for a ban and they'll not be providing services in the IT city. Now this has caused inconvenience to many Bengaluru citizens who have been opting for public BMTC buses, metros and other public transport. The Karnataka state government following the ban has also uh, no, uh, provided more number of buses. 500 more BMTC buses have been provided today to ensure that no inconvenience is caused to the city of uh, Bengaluru citizens. And uh, But still, at the very same time, the demand continues. At 11 a.m. in Freedom Park at Bengaluru, uh, the private transport association vehicle uh, members, they'll also be staging a protest, pressing their demands, demanding that the Karnataka Shakti scheme, the Congress government Shakti scheme, one of its poll promises, which is uh, right now implemented for the government buses is also extended to the private transport or a monetary compensation that needs to be provided to them. These are the two main demands and there are various other demands by the transport association to ensure that their lifetime tax is being cut for their vehicles or the rapido bike taxi uh, which they claim that is been causing a inconvenience and loss to the auto rickshaws and cab drivers. They demand this rapido bike taxi uh, to be taken back to be banned in Bengaluru. So these are the various demands that have been put forth by the private transport association who have called for a ban and uh, very shortly they will also be staging a mega protest. Uh, at the very same time the transport minister who has held a meeting with this uh, transport associations, the private transport association has assured that he will speak to the chief minister but he cannot promise that all the demands that will be fulfilled but still we'll have to wait and watch what the decision of the government will be. Will the government go ahead and you know, provide and extend the Shakti scheme to the private transport associations or provide a monetary compensation to compensate for the loss which the private transport associations claim that they have been facing because of the Karnataka government Shakti scheme. Reporting for CNN News 18, Akshara DM with camera person Riyas.